Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Our HOC star Shannon Beater is putting her DUI case in the rearview mirror, so to speak. It may have happened less than a year ago, but the mother of three is letting go of the past. So how is she doing this? Keep reading for more details. When Shannon Beater got arrested for a DUI hit-and-run incident in September 2023, it should have been a wake-up call. That RHHOC star had been accused of drinking too much in the past. Plus, in season 17, she allegedly would drink, call her co-stars to vent about her relationship with John Jansen, and then forget she did such a thing. It was also a full-circle moment as she'd had spoken about castmate Gina Kirschenheider's DUI moment, but fabricated some details. Along with that, she took credit for saving Gina when it all went down, so this was a very interesting moment. Shannon tried to act like she was just walking her dog, Archie, after the hit and run, but that was not the case. Eventually, she was sentenced to community service and tried to avoid alcohol. When she was at BravoCon 2023, she was allegedly seen sticking to water. However, in the clips for season 18 of RHOC, Shannon is openly ordering cocktails that involve alcohol. Now, according to In Touch Weekly, she has officially completed her community service. Shannon had to do 40 hours and was able to do it in four days at a non-profit organization. Shannon Beter had to complete her community service by July 16, 2024, but was done by June 13. This makes sense given that season 18 of RHOC premieres on July 11. Therefore, she will likely have a lot of press to do for the show. She did not just receive community service, but also three years of informal probation, nine-month alcohol education classes, and fines slash fees. The reality star got off easy considering that the prosecutor was seeking 30 days in jail. The OCDA, Todd Spitzer, had this to say after the decision was handed down. The community service part may be behind Shannon Beater, but reliving the incident is about to happen. RHOC season 18 will bring it all back up as she retells the story. More than that, she will come face to face with John Jansen's new girlfriend, Alexis Bellino. Bellino was in the cast from seasons 5 through 8 and is now a friend of, becoming very close to Tamara Judge. Tamara and Shannon are no longer friends so that will make it even more dramatic. Plus, John is suing Shannon for $75,000, so it is not the best time in her life. Are you shocked that she did her community service so fast and that it was only 40 hours? Let us know in the comments below and watch RHOC July 11th on Bravo. Amanda has been a professional freelance writer for over a decade, holding both a BA and an MA. Her passions include animals, iced coffee, gnomes, summer, music, and Vanderpump Rules.